are your final thoughts on the film festival tonight? It hasn't even started. How could it be my final <laughs> thoughts? I'm not like as in your final overall. Like, what do you think it's gonna be like? I don't know. You're We're going to a college. Film, featured in the film. Are you gonna be uncomfortable watching it? I'm not gonna. Uh, why would you do that to me? I don't know. You're in it though. You're a part, big part of it. Okay. I'm excited. You're excited? Yes. Wow. That was the first time you said you're excited. What? So, tomorrow I am leaving for a film festival. I have to wake up super early, probably around like 6.20 a.m. because my flight boards at 7.45 and then departs at 8.20, I think. So we're attending the film festival tonight. It starts at 7.30. It's in Gilroy, California, which is like two hours away from here. So we're gonna be in the car for a little bit, but I'm pretty excited for it. Not really sure what to expect, like I said yesterday, but I don't know. I don't know how many people are gonna be watching it. It could be like 10 people, it could be 20 people, it could be like 100 people. No idea how many people are gonna be there, but I don't know, it should be a fun time. I'm excited to see how it turns out. We've been in the city all morning. We just took some pictures, had a nice little photo shoot. Yeah, it's been a good visit home. Should be a fun film festival tonight. We'll see you there. Do you have anything to say about the film festival we're going to tonight? Poppy Jasper will be a great success. You can't hear anything you're saying. It's not my fault. You're gonna have to scream. So, Poppy Jasper was founded in 1976. That's so, Josh is gonna get an Oscar. I'm not getting an Oscar. Maybe a uh, Grammy. What were your overall thoughts on the Heart City? I don't know, I didn't watch it. <laughs> <laughs> what? You haven't seen it? No. No, you've seen it. Do you think it's gonna be weird, like, watching it? I don't think I'm gonna watch it. I don't. I've been watching it.
went through basically. So it was a really like traumatic experience for me, and I just like kind of didn't really want to think about it. So I just had to call her to remind me like everything that happened. Mm -hmm. And I didn't really have that many like clips or videos of me like going through it or like the actual surgery or anything. So I just thought it'd be a good idea to get like stock images and stock videos because it kind of helps you like see everything and picture it out. It's just like better visually to like understand what was going on. And then like I would just speak over that and just make the story as clear as possible. Yeah. Um, how long did it take you to do it? Um, it took a while because I was just starting college when I like started making the film, so I was busy with schoolwork and like meeting people and going out and doing things. So I think it took me about a month and a half to like just complete the entire thing. So yeah. Yeah. Got a question? <laughs> how did you get the tempo? Oh, the music? No, just the, and your cadence of talking. Like, what did you model that after? Because it's not what I normally hear you talk mm -hmm. like. So. <laughs> That's true, yeah. It's just, it, was, it was really effective, yeah. Yeah, I wanted to make it flow as fast as possible because there's a lot of information, and I didn't want to make it, like, too slow. Like, I feel like it could get boring, and, like, it would just lose people's attention spans and everything. So I just thought, like, the faster I talk, the faster I get through information, like, it would be the most interesting, and you'd, like, watch till the end. Jordan. Hey, uh, I really enjoyed the film. Um, Thank you. Obviously, it's a really personal uh, story, and I was just wondering um, if there was like a specific point uh, you can pinpoint of when you decided that you wanted to tell that story in that way. Um, well, basically, that was like the biggest thing that's ever happened to me. Like, that was probably the scariest time in my life, and I went through a lot, like emotionally and physically, obviously. So I just wanted to like mainly let my friends and family know what was going on because we told them like what was going on and everything, but they didn't know the full extent. And I just wanted to like be able to express like everything that I went through so they knew and just like could understand what was going on. You know, the only thing I noticed that you left out and I was curious as to why is the doctors gave you a percentage like this, you have this um, chance to make it. Yeah. And you never mentioned that in the film. Yeah, that's true. I probably should add that in. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to tell people what you, the doctor was like? Uh, <laughs> I honestly don't really remember. It was a while ago. It was. Wasn't it like a ten percent? It was something. Well, ninety percent of infants don't make it through the first year with that defect. Oh. So it's really a. Kind of a miracle that he survived to 17 years of age. But the actual surgery, what? Yeah, what, yeah that was kind of a scary thing when. Um, I don't know. The surgeon was pretty straightforward, and he just kind of told us what he was going to do with operation. And he said he felt really confident, but I don't know if he gave us a specific percentage. Oh. The other thing I liked about it was the little ordinary things about, you know, not ordinary, but just what, what unfortunate timing, like with your car. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it's huge incidents, and it's like, there's just like ordinary things that could happen, but just yeah. like such bad timing. <laughs> and one of, it was just, it, you know, it's just a good thing to add because it's part of the story and it's part of just like, oh, it's just pretty hard. It was life. <laughs> yeah, just life. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Any other questions? Uh, I just want to know where you go. To, where do you go to school at, and do you major in film? Yeah, I go to Arizona State University, and I'm majoring in filmmaking. Currently, yeah. It was a really good overview. Hey, thank you so much. Just everything um, in a nutshell. Yeah. It was very informative. Very good overview. It was. Thank you. It was great. I appreciate it. And. Um, what, what's next for you? You got the film in your head, or? Um, I have a few ideas. Haven't really started writing anything yet, but right now I'm just going to school, helping people with different films. Like I've been on set a couple times. Oh, that's good. That's been interesting. So, yeah. yeah, it's yeah. Right now. That's a big help. You can mm -hmm. see how where they make their mistakes. <laughs> oh yeah, exactly. It's a good learning experience. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, that's great. Any other questions? Comments? Well, thank you so Great much for job. coming.